today is t t Tuesday. Ronnie got the, oh, someone's calling. Ronnie got the cabinets up on the wall. These are, still aren't in there permanently, but he got the sink in. Um, so that's doing good. My dentist this morning, it was just a, to see what's happening in there. Um, I got to go back next Wednesday for the whole whatever they're going to do. He's going to try to fill it. He says, I'm hoping to fill it. Follow, And if not, he was able to do the one on top, which was the same kind of break. Um, he said, if any more damage happens to it, it might have to be a crown. But he said, looking at it, at it right now, because I told him, I said, oh, yeah, I've been trying to chew on this side. And he goes, don't worry about it. It looks pretty. He said, it's not rot, rotten or anything. And it was just one chunk of the tooth just fell out. He said, everything else looks good. Um, so I go back Wednesday in the morning. So I just get to live with a chunk of my tooth out. There goes a bicycle. Ronnie got here. This it was funny because I had an 8 a.m. doctor uh, dentist appointment. Then we got payroll up to the shop. By the time we got up to the shop, it was like 9. And at my phone rings, I'm like, he's like, hey, I'm almost to your house. And I'm like, hey, I'm at the shop. <laughs> I didn't think they were coming home until they were. I didn't think they were coming home till tonight. But they came home last night, I guess. Um, so then a few minutes later he goes, Hey, where's the key? Cause we moved it for when Shane was doing work and I told him where it was now. So when we got home, he had already had the cab cabinets up on the wall. Um, he just finished doing the sink. So now we have water and, uh, we don't have any of the poles on any of the cabinets yet, but they're, they're here cause they, we ordered them when we ordered the cabinets and dad couldn't remember us doing that. So they went down and bought a few pulls so we could have some on our cupboards and I'm like dad you were with me when we ordered these well I don't remember <laughs> um so he's taking those back and then when Ronnie was here the mutter Shane's like I'm gonna be heading your way in a minute so Ron got out right before the next crew comes in to do mudding in here it's a busy a busy day when I didn't think there was really gonna be anything happening today so, yeah. I have a feeling this is going to be a vlog where I film some Tuesday and some Wednesday, but we'll see. It's so dark in here, but somebody's glad all the banging's done for the day. She came and got in her bed. Right, kitty? Are you happy now? Okay, I'm going to go over here by the light. I know y'all can't see much, but kitty's down here getting beat up with a back scratcher. She loves this thing. Keeps going out of oh, Don't eat it. You can't eat it. I think she's out of focus. But okay. Say good night, everybody. We'll see you tomorrow. Happy Tuesday. I'm all blurry. Are you going to come? There you are. There you are in focus now. Yeah. Happy Wednesday. It is a windy mofo here talking very windy many air many spots around the area does not have power we have not lost power thank goodness we are just taking out for a ride. our mother just came to the house so he got to work and we're like well let's get out of your hair we'll just go for a ride or something so that's what we're doing we have no idea where we're going or what we're doing we're just getting away so we don't bug him I said dad you could have just sat in your recliner and watched TV it would have been just the same he goes I just don't feel like I just feel like I'm gonna bug him <laughs> so <laughs> I asked him, I said, because the first day Shane was there and we left and we came home, about a half hour after we left, Jenny Mae started calling my dad's sister and Ronnie's mom. And I said, today I said, Shane, so what did you think about all those, listening to those messages from Jenny Mae? She, he goes, my goodness, I could not believe she called that many times and just talked and talked and talked. So since that first day, dad has taken the phone into the bedroom when we go away so it doesn't bother him. He goes, I did not realize. He goes, I went home and I mentioned it to his girlfriend who works for us. She goes, oh yeah, I have to deal with that too at work. <laughs> but now I gotta go pick up dad. We're getting mail and I'm parked across the street watching all the leaves go. Oh, here he comes, gotta go by. We took a ride over here by Lake Michigan and it is windy and there's waves all over the place. It doesn't take the paint right But now we're gonna get away from here so we don't get sandblasted driving out of the park 
and uh, you come you come along the lake for a little bit. It is lots of white caps, many many white caps, and then we get to drive out through the woods and do dodge all the sticks and branches in the road. There aren't many here, but down this way I had to dodge a few things. It is windy out today. Very very windy. It always makes me wonder how many toilets got tipped over. But okay, now I got to drive out. Wheatberry. Yeah, we're at Wheatberry. We're using our yeah. card, buy a meal, get one free. We're right on the river. And the trees are swaying a little bit. There's a little tree down over here, but we'll show you when our dinner comes. I got shrimp with spinach and there's rice under there. And Dad got a little steak with broccoli and mashed potatoes. And we got some fries to share. I love their shrimp here. It's called New Orleans Barbecue Shrimp. But now I gotta go because there's music playing in here. We just got home. Her mother was here today again when we left. And uh, it's starting to actually look like, instead of gaping holes up there, it's starting to look like a ceiling and a wall meeting instead of just holes. And uh, there's outside. Someone's calling. Who could it be? But yeah, it's a process, but it's still going. He filled in all our little holes where we had nails today too. We were marking them for him. But okay, goodbye. Someone just came in. She ate, and then she went there. She'd been in the basement all day since, you know. Although the mutter isn't all that loud, but he's a stranger, and she's like, "No, stranger danger!" Right, Kitty? She's, she's too tired to care. But now, I'm going to wrap this up. This Thanksgiving Eve for all of us U.S. folks. And um, Wednesday night for all you other folks. So, I'll film tomorrow when I'm out at Thanksgiving, like always. And um, you see how big the boys are getting? So, happy Wednesday. Goodbye.